Hey guys, good morning. Just wanted to make a quick update video. It is just before market open on Friday, May 8th. It's 9.27 a.m. Looks like AMD is still hovering around the $52 mark. And if you remember from my previous videos, I have four contracts, four covered calls on AMD at the $52 strike price that are expiring today at the end of the day. So if AMD closes above $52, I'll make roughly, actually exactly $368 in profit for this week. And I will get my 400 shares called away, which is what I want. So I can free up that capital to invest in more options come Monday. So I was thinking yesterday about what I would do if AMD closes below $52, meaning I keep my full premium of $368, or sorry, $268 and I keep my 400 shares. I say $268 because $100 of that profit was from the stock appreciation because my average cost is $51.75 per share. And if I sell them at $52 a share, I would make 25 cents per share. 25 cents times 400 is $100. So I would, if AMD closes below $52, by end of day today, which is possible looking at what AMD has been doing yesterday and already pre-market. I have the option of I can either sell more four more covered calls for the following week at $52 and kind of just hope for the same thing that by Friday of next week, AMD closes above $52 and let's say make roughly another 200 some or 300 some dollars profit for that week. Which is not bad. It would be about a one, a little over one percent return on my money in another week. So not bad at all. Or what I could do is I could not sell any covered calls because I own 400 shares of AMD stock, and I could hope or just watch the market throughout the week and see if AMD goes higher in value because. There was a point earlier in the week that AMD, I think was around $53 or so. Let's see, 52, 52. Yeah, so it was, I thought there was a point in the middle of the day, May 6th, there we go. So May 5th, yeah, May 5th, it was hovering around $53. And if I didn't have my option on at the time, I could have sold my shares just straight up stock for a decent profit as well because $53 minus my cost basis of $51.75 per share, that would have been a $1.25 profit per share times my 400 shares. I would have made $500 on May 5th if I sold at around $53. And I had sold, started these options on Monday, May 4th. So I would have made $500 in about a day. So again, hindsight is 2020, but I'm kind of thinking about that instead of just going ahead and selling covered calls first thing Monday morning at market open, why don't I see what the market does and try and see if I can just sell my stock outright. Um, because even if it's at, let's say 52.50, 52.50, again, minus 51.75, which is my cost basis per share. That's 75 cents per share profit times 400. That's $300 right there. So I could say, you know what? Come Monday, I'm just gonna set a limit sell at 52.50. So if AMD gets the 52.50 at any point during that week, it'll automatically sell my shares and I'll make a quick $300 profit rather than holding those 400 shares all week long until next Friday, hoping that it's above $52 by end of day Friday. So let's see what the market does today. Let's see what my position is at the end of the day. And I'll recap with you either tonight evening or tomorrow during the day at some point. It's 9.31 now. The market just opened up. Looks like AMD is literally at $52 right now. So. Yeah, let's see what the market does today. Let's see what AMD does today. And I'll keep you posted. As always, let me know in the comments if you guys have any plays or trades you're looking at, what your plan is for this weekend or come this morning. 
If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Smash that like button, give me a subscribe, and as always, happy trading.